blisters can suck. Those two blisters that you see on the bottom of my toes, I got a few years ago when I was doing a lot of boxing training. They were seriously painful. Just the other day, I got a, another blister on the bottom of my big toe. Not from jumping rope, but from a different form of exercise. But just because you have a blister or you have some injury doesn't mean you have to stop exercising. So I have a, a blister on the bottom of my, of my big toe, as you might be able to see there. It's almost healed, but still I can't really put too much uh, weight on it. I can't do too much uh, physical activity. I can do upper body work, but not too much lower body work. That said, I'm still going to do some jump rope. I'm going to do some one foot hops using just my right leg. So I really feel like jumping rope today, but because I have that blister on the bottom of my foot, I can't do some regular skipping, but I'm still going to do some one foot hops. I think I'll do, I don't know, maybe 1,000 one foot hops on my right leg, just using my right leg. All right, so I think I'll do them in maybe sets of 100 at a time. Let's see how it goes. 10. Maybe I won't even count. I'll just keep going for a while. When I get tired, I'll take a break and uh, I'll continue. Now, one foot hops, I've made some uh, tutorial videos on them. They're a great jump rope move, but they are quite difficult because one leg or one foot has to support your entire body weight. So, in order to do them without getting injured, you need to use proper technique. Notice that I'm not jumping high off the ground here. If you jump too high off the ground when you're doing one foot hops, it can easily lead to shin splints and uh, pain in your calves and your Achilles tendon. Okay, I'll take a short rest now. So these one foot hops, as I said, because you're supporting your entire body weight on one leg, it can, they can be quite challenging. Right now, the outside of my calves are burning quite intensely right now. The back of my legs, my calf muscles, are also burning a lot and feeling quite tight. So one foot hops, they're tremendous jump rope move for building strength in your lower legs building good fitness in your in your legs but they are demanding so if you're going to do them make sure you use proper jump rope form and maybe I highly recommend checking out the tutorial video I made on one foot hops oh, it's a beautiful day here today it's uh, windy but it's uh, sunny it's absolutely great to get outside and do some uh, exercise. Those one foot hops, if you do them, and if you do quite a few reps in a row, you'll notice that your thigh also begins to fatigue and feel quite hard. It's almost like you've been cycling uphill for a good, a good distance. Once you're doing one foot hops, you can really feel your thigh working a lot too. So they're a fabulous exercise for strengthening your leg muscles. So just because you have an injury or blister doesn't mean you have to stop exercising or doing an activity that you love. You might just have to adapt. A few years ago I had a really bad injury to my right foot. I was on crutches for approximately six weeks. And at that time, I had a, uh, a trip book, a trip booked to uh, France and Paris. Sorry, Paris and Rome, rather, as well as uh, Ireland. And because I had a lower leg injury, it made it a little bit more difficult to get around and explore those cities. But one great thing about having those injuries is it really slowed me down. And because it slowed me down, I was able to really take in and appreciate the surroundings. Sometimes in life, we're always going, 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 moving so fast, and we don't notice all the beauty around us. 
But because I was, my motion was really limited, my injury prevented me from moving fast. It forced me to slow down. And because I was slowed down, I really took in the surroundings. After this, I'll do some upper body strength movements and maybe some heavy bag training while staying pretty still. All right, so you saw some uh, footage from my uh, jump rope workout today. Uh, because I have a bit of an injury on my left foot, I was kind of limited to what I could do today. And because I was doing a lot of one foot hops on my right leg, when my left toe and that blister heals, I'll do some single leg hopping for my left leg, just uh, to have some nice balance. All right, well, I hope you enjoyed this uh, short video. Thanks for watching. Until next time, it's uh, really windy here. All right, cheers.